Up in Lebanon now, city officials have expressed hesitance at increasingly supporting the Lebanon airport financially. The Valley News reports that last week, the city council told Lebanon airport officials that there is in fact a limit as to how much money they're willing to pump into the airport. Now, the airport had asked to hire a consultant from the business, but the council was unsure on whether to spend the requested 70 grand when the work could be done in-house instead. The paper says that the airport can't survive on its own and has required increasing amounts of money from the city over the past two years. Now, the airport will slowly be upgraded over the next 20 years as the city approved a long-term plan to fix federal safety issues. Now, the city will be paying for roughly $2 million of those upgrades, while the Federal Aviation Administration will be covering the rest at roughly $47 million. Now, one airline runs out of the Lebanon airport currently, that being Cape Air, but used to be serviced by three different airlines that offered a wider variety of destinations than the current ones of Boston and White Plains, New York. The city is going to look at previous reports and master plans of the airport to discuss a future business plan moving forward.